history. It's, it's happened. When was the last time we did this? Do we know? People have wanted it. <laughs> it's a big week, and they're getting it. Uh, I don't is, know. We were trying to figure it out. This is literally, I know that DraftKings would not have made this deal with Dave if this wasn't part of it. First like, thing you text me. I, Gary, like, I could tell you that for a fact. I don't think you put any other context in. You just said deal breaker, right? Yeah, and I think I think DraftKings have been great to us. Obviously, we've been negotiating. People like, you want to do every tournament. I feel like anybody can do that. You want to do the players. Anybody can do that. But when major season shows up, we show up. And credit to you because, you know, I was I was itching. I was jonesing yeah. to get this thing going, and we were considering going for the Players' Championship. Right. And you said we're, our, we're Masters kind of guys. Right. Right. It's Masters week. Right. DraftKings sports. I don't really believe you, much like that Springsteen trip to Phoenix. It was just, it was a mirage. It wasn't rooted in reality. I thought you were on a flight out. <laughs> you were, you were in like North Carolina. You got to be on a flight out here, right? <laughs> that was going to be a fun trip. Yes, really well, fun trip. some other day. So Still we're, never seen Bruce. Would have been a great time. So we're back. The show has a title. Chasing came, Greens. Yeah, wow. I'm, I'm, how much thought was put into that? So I want you to know that I actually came up with that name thinking it was so bad that it would force you to come up with a better name. I, I'm terrible at naming things. And you just said, terrible. yeah, I know. That was, <clears throat> you have two shows, if you count the first gambling show, named, unnamed <laughs> yeah, show. Unnamed show, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Is that why this isn't called the unnamed show? It's not. It's, yeah, we got bumped. We're apparently. chasing greens, because greens is the green in the golf course, and then money. You get it. You get it. But, but why would you be chasing the green on the golf course? Because that's where you putt. Oh. Chasing greens. You're chasing it? Yeah, you're chasing. Okay, all right. You're just chasing around. We have a title. We have a title. I had to get on there. Well, you're at Augusta, so give me some insight. Obviously, you're. Is, is, if it rains on, when is this going to be up? Do we know? I think we're. This is currently live. I think. Oh, it is. Are I we think live? This is a live show. And oh, is it really? <laughs> well, no, I'm saying it's live Wednesday. It's, oh, like we should say it was live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure, it's we're live, right? Wednesday. Okay. I was like, what the <laughs> fuck? Like, oh, I was excited. <laughs> it's, uh, all I right, think so it's we're live. We're live on Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Yeah, it's Wednesday. You shot six over first round mini golf. You'll be fine. Don't worry about it. I wonder what kind of head space we're in right now due oh. to the mini golf standing. Oh, yeah, I, I, I don't know. If, we'll see. Um, Masters with them will be tomorrow if you're listening now or watching. Um, you were at Augusta uh, through Tuesday morning. Well, give me. If it rains Thursday, I think it changes the entire tournament. If they get dumped on, obviously it changes all of the hype because right now, as everyone's saying, it's firm, it's fast. fast Tiger yeah. Woods said in his press conference mm -hmm. that he was here a couple weeks ago. It was the best he'd ever seen it. It's only gotten better ever since then. So that's kind of the MO. They got no rain last week really during the and while. They've gotten none over the weekend. They got a, a little bit of a mist, I think, on Tuesday morning. But otherwise, it's supposed to be very firm. Augusta's got the sub air and the whole deal. So hopefully firm, fast, makes it fun, more interesting. All the little shelves are smaller. That's yep. kind of what we're looking for. All right. Do you want to – do you want – we haven't done this in a while. We have a good rhythm. Who usually goes first traditionally? You? I do. Go ahead. The floor is yours. All right. I'm going to lead with uh, – I'm going to lead with one that is is uh, something that we try to do week to week, but because of the, the Masters tournament and what they do on 16 on Sunday. Uh-oh, yep. We got to get one it's before we get to it's Sunday. Yeah. So I'm going two oh. or more. Oh, wow, on 16. Two or more aces throughout the whole tournament. Let me ask you a question. Let's see if you know the answer to this. Wow. When was the last time somebody made a hole-in-one on 12, and who made it? I, I think I'm going to get the year right, but. I want to say it was. <sighs> Take your time. I think it's been a long time. Uh-huh. That's, that's not a year. Has it been like 20 or 30 years? Can you just make a fucking guess? I don't Is know who it, it was. Okay. Well, pick a player in a year. 1990. Three. Okay. Player? Tom Kite. That's not a bad guess. I believe I could be wrong. I think it was Curtis Strange in 1989. Oh, man. Nobody that's, goes to that. Like, even, nobody even makes a mistake. Like, nobody goes near that pin. That's nuts because... It's that, 160 yards. Especially when they do the front left pin. Yeah. Guys are hitting wedges it's like, in there. It's, but you nobody goes near it. It's so, a nice soft day. Nobody makes a hole in one on four. There's like no aces on four. Six. You have a chance on six. Yeah, but, but it's got to be, yeah. There's it's, not. This is a 16 bet. It's kind of a 16 yeah, bet. Yeah, I, I, I think that's a good bet. What's the number? What it is odds? plus 225 for two or more aces I actually like that on the entire tournament. And like I said, I feel like we need to get one Thursday through Friday, or Thursday through Saturday. So then uh -huh. Sunday, we're going to be throwing darts at that at that back left pin, and everybody kind of knows how that works. So that's, uh, that's my first bet, plus 225. There are two or more hole in... 
Holes in one in the tournament. Holes in one. Okay. Uh, I am going to go. Are you in on that with me? Yes, I'm with you on that Come one. Come on, Kirk. I'm going to, I'm going to go, as you know me, kind of conservative to start. Mm-hmm. Top 30 parlay. The, the, by the way, this is all, of course, our friends at DraftKings, Riggs. DraftKings Sports. Yes, DraftKings Sports. Uh, they're right. great partners. If they people are. don't know, we've teamed up with DraftKings. We have. Plus 180. Plus, I beg your pardon. That's not plus 180. I'm wrong. It is uh, plus 165. I don't my glasses on. John Rom. Powering through without the glasses. Yeah, I left frame. the hotel room. John Rom. How about that AC trick I showed you? <laughs> Are you in these? I mean, I, I, you I, you see the meter. I can see you going to your room. It's like 74 degrees. No, no, no. worry no, about that. You. Don't be an asshole. I would say <laughs> I'm, but I'm not as low as a lot of you guys. You, I, like I, don't it, go. I like it cold. I like to be naked in the room. I like the AC blowing my asshole. Yeah, you sleep you sleep naked in hotel room beds? Yes, because yeah. I, I, hotel room, if it's 68 degrees in a hotel room, it's like 80 degrees. Hotel room is yeah, never. Hotter. That's true, that's true. If, if it's 20 degrees, I want the AC on. I it, usually I put to it get to 60 degrees. I put it down to about 66 usually. That's, a, that's not bad. No, it's not crazy. Mario Lemieux. You're 66. not going lower than that for my hack. Rarely unless okay. it's a bad, uh, an overly hot hotel room. Plus 165, John Rahm. I'm, you know, I get nervous about these live guys. This is my, this is a live play here. Yeah. John Rom, Hideki Matsuyama, Cam Smith, all top thirty plus one sixty five. Now, top thirty at the Masters is easier. Yep, because uh, half the field are, you know, you're well, the smaller field first of all, and then you have. Was it ninety? Eighty nine? Ninety four this 94? year? Ninety four. Okay. There, there are fewer, like guys this year, like VJ and Freddie, and there's not Ola Thaw, but it's not that many get longer. It's not playing. Mize and Lyle are out. The amateurs are okay, but I mean, to me, this is a Cam Smith bet. I think Rahm and Hideki are going to finish the top thirty. I just don't know where Cam Smith's head at. Um, his putting stats are unbelievable, though. I think he's the best putter of the gust the last five years. Whew. He's not been great, but I, I don't know what to do about. Like John Rahm is a one on live, but I don't know if that even matters. I don't think it does. I don't either. So I'm going to go with those. You don't like that? I can tell you don't like that one. Uh, I, just because it's so unpredictable with the live guys, I don't. So I, unpredictable. I know really it's a surprising it. live bet for me. I don't know who's playing well over there. You don't watch their form. Sometimes you can you can see if a guy, you know, like I looked at uh, JT Poston, and he finished 45th or something in the Players' Championship, but his final round he shot like 78. So I was like, he actually had a really strong tournament. Right. You just, I can't really get that feel for the live guys because I feel like I'm not really watching as often. So Fair. I'm All a right. little nervous about that one, Kurt. Go ahead. I respect it. Okay. Uh, Wyndham Clark, who it's I'm going to have- play there. I'm going to have a good amount on. It's never been there. Never played the Masters, which I f- that, that surprised me when I saw that. Just I'll just I, let you know I don't love him this week. I like him this week. Uh, and I really like this this bet. Uh, this is my only one on my whole wait, wait, okay, go ahead. list here that is minus money. Uh, to go rigs bet. Wyndham Clark over three and a half birdies in the first round. Minus 115. I think it's going to be a little soft. It's going to be a little bit of uh, okay. rain out there. He's hits the ball a mile. I feel like he's the kind of guy that could make five or six birdies, four or five bogeys. So even if he doesn't have a magical round in terms of going really low, I think he's going to make over three birdies. So I got Clark minus 115 is over three and a half birdies. I'm going to give you a little insight early when I'm thinking because I have to pick this. I don't want to pick him to win, but Scheffler. Oh, Scotty. Okay, that's Rom mm-hmm. or Hideki to win plus 225. I, uh, yeah. Yeah. That seems... Plus 225? Plus 225. Mm. Give me those three guys. Um, and also Brooks is plus 230. I'm staying away from Brooks. I fall in this trap, but I just don't... I don't I don't trust him. I just... I, I don't know. I know it doesn't matter. He's not playing well, but I'm, I'm not falling into that again. But I like th- those three guys. I, I, I am... Going in on that one. So there, these are in the triple chance. If you go to triple the, chance, yes, our good friends at DraftKings Sportsbook, the old triple chance. I'm not going to take that one. The other one I do like in here has two guys that I know you don't love at good. this event. Mm-hmm. You just said one of them, Brooks. Yeah, uh, I got Scotty Brooks and Rory is plus two hundred. Scotty Brooks and Rory at plus two hundred. Any of those guys? Oh yeah, Scotty, win. Scotty and Rory. Yeah, I don't hate that. I don't hate that. I feel like Rory's under the radar this year, which he never really is going into the Masters. Correct. I feel like that could be good for him. Yep. This time last year, he was sort of the guy. He was the man leading. He was the prince of the PGA Tour and all yep. that, rah, rah, rah. Uh, going in, he had won the, the Tour Championship FedEx Cup the year before, the whole deal. Now, not really playing that well. Not the best form. He went and saw Butch Harmon. I, I just think there's a, a, 
a better chance for Rory mindset wise going in this year. Do you like? So you, you I mean, do you? I mean, do you think Rory? You, you only Rory's going to win though. Are you picking Rory to win right now? Or? No, but I'm pairing him up with Scotty, which is fun. Yeah. And Brooks Kepka. It stinks without Scheffler. It stinks with the Scheffler factor. Like it just changes. What are Scheffler's top ten odds, for example? Is that that's got to be minus money, right? Oh, it's got to be. I bet it's pretty. Top twenty. It's minus four fifty. <laughs> it's like, how do you? What do you even? You know, I don't even know what to do with that. Uh, I can't go near it. It is a. It, it is obviously a guarantee that he's going to be in contention. Yeah, it's just if he puts well or not. Yeah, he's playing right. well. That's right. Uh, top twenty plus one eighty, um, plays great here. Not having the best year. Now we're going to get into our wheelhouse. Corey Connors. Oh, plus one eighty. Great Augusta record. My kind of guy. Hits the ball great. If he can make any putts, I think he's going to contend. Plus one eighty. Corey. These are our guys. We're now in like the Scheffler, Rory, all, Corey Connors time. Plus uh, plus one eighty. Top twenty. Now, I was dancing around. Do you do you like Denny McCarthy plus two thirty or no? Yeah. Top, you do. You're gonna go with yeah. me on that one. Okay. That rolls wedge, it. That, rolls it unbelievable. That wedge didn't bother you last week. Nope. <sighs> didn't bother me. The guy made what seven birdies in a row leading up to that. I think he made eight. Or he shot eight under, right? Yeah, I think on the back nine. Yeah. Uh, the wedge was a little concerning. I'll be honest with you, but he got that out of his system. Yeah. Anytime you chili dip one into the into it's the creek concerning. there, yeah. And there's some creeks at Augusta that are pretty prominent. So, <sighs> it's a top twenty for those two guys. You're, you're with me on McCarthy, but you're yeah. not loving uh, Corey Connors. I'm not gonna go crazy on Connors, okay. but yeah. I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go McCarthy. I like his game. Go I like ahead. what I saw. Uh, I'm gonna go on the uh, top twenty. Like I said, this is sort of our. This is sort of our wheelhouse. We made a lot, top twenty, top thirties. We made a lot of our bones in the past. But I mean, listeners of the show and viewers of the show are, are very happy that we're doing this. Again. Yeah, yeah. They this they feel very comfortable. Yeah, this um, is our world. I'm going. Uh, let's see. I can't decide with my guy, the Jaeger bomb. You love. You do love him. He was one of my go tos. You love him. Last year during the iconic run of this show, I'm gonna go. Uh, he's plus one sixty five. To mm-hmm. finish in the top thirty, so I'm that's going. not bad. Steven Yeager, plus one sixty five, top thirty. I am looking at the. I'm gonna do my one minus bet, minus one fifteen. Typical Kerr. Uh, a streak will end. Oh, no. Tiger Woods will be going home after Friday. I, minus, I knew minus one fifty. They've been Tiger. harping it up too. He's tied with who? A couple other guys. Yeah, one is Gary Player, and one is uh, the 1992 champion Fred Couples. Twenty four straight. Twenty three straight. Oh, I don't want to see that record broken. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> no, you don't. And I'm don't. picking Tiger. Who everyone now? Freddie. This year it's Will Zalatoris. Usually it's Freddie J. Oh, he's never hit the ball better. He looks <laughs> great. He's hitting the three. Your guy was in on that. Big Freddie time. for sure. Freddie like, was in on that. Oh, he's never played better. Oh, he didn't miss a shot all day. Like he, every Tuesday, he must shoot seven under. Freddie almost start. He smirks now when he says it. Yeah, he kind of yeah, knows he's, he's that what he's yeah. doing. But I'm like, taking. I'm taking Tiger to miss the. I don't think he's gonna make the cut this week. Okay, that's I minus am. money. So I wouldn't bet it if I was. But I'm just telling you that's. That's uh, yeah, and I mean there's some decent plus guys to miss the cut too that I like, but uh, I did sprinkle some on Tiger Woods to win the tournament. It's good so it's a really good. If we're gonna do this, you, you know, t- that was defeating. That was not optimistic Tiger talk today. No, like, everything no, goes no, right. No. And one more time, you're texting me on Sunday. Oh, he's gonna. You know, he's gonna he I thought he was go- gonna. I thought he was gonna win 19 majors and win and take over the title yeah, as of Sunday. And then he gonna- said, if everything goes right, basically if like lightning strikes at the proper time. I could win one more. I didn't. I've never heard anything like that from Tiger Woods. This is a, this is. I'm, I try not to get you dirty on the show. Oh God! I'll say Tiger will be boinking on Friday night. The, he better be. I mean, the, once he misses the cut, then he's good to go. Miss the cut or not, I need him boinking on Friday night. Well, no, if he makes the cut, right if he's, you, well, I'm gonna keep doing it. No, I just still, I still don't feel great about it. He's not a make the cut kind of player. I give you a plus three hundred to miss the cut too, Matt Fitzpatrick. Missed the cut, plus you, 300. I will say, I want to say last year I we did the show, my ass on, the yeah. first time that we went negative, Matt Fitzpatrick, he like won. He won I think he won the tournament. <laughs> so we got to be so up and down, though. <laughs> the Rapport factor, I'm yep. plus 300 for Matt Fitzpatrick to uh, to miss the cut. All right. I've got, uh, I've got Sahith Thagala. Yeah, I like him a lot this week. Top twenty. Yeah. Uh, yep. Go ahead. Plus one sixty. I'm in. I'm in with you on that. I, um, I think he's. I think he finished top ten this week. Great. I love it. Um, I get a top five parlay if you want it. Mm, I do. Give it to me. <sighs> these are tough. These make me nervous, but I'm going in. 
plus 1900, 1900, Rory McIlroy and Hideki Matsuyama. To miss a cut? No, to top five parlay. Oh, top five, top five parlay. parlay. Yeah, those are tough. There's not. You know. I agree. Um, oh, how many spots are there? It's not, <laughs> are there five? Do ties count? Yeah. Uh, no. Ooh. No, nope, I'm doing it. I'm rolling okay. the dice. That's that's, it, that's, that's that, plus nineteen hundred. <laughs> uh, okay. I think you uh, figure out. I fucking love Hideki this week. You're crazy about Hideki. He's playing great this year. Has he been? Yes. You watch golf. He, will he? Not really. Not, oh, that, well, not that often. Reasonable answer. I guess. <laughs> no, I don't, don't find it overly entertaining. Yeah, on sure. The, I understand. Top level that often. Yeah. Uh, I like Hideki here a lot. I get, you know, now I, I love that he walking through the ropes after he won is always a part of their little cut-ups now. Oh, they love it. And they love the caddy, too. Oh, big time. Caddy doing I like to see him do that again. Yeah, we sold those t-shirts there. It's a little that's right. questionable on the taste on that one. Okay. That's right. Yes, go ahead. But I will say his caddy sent one back. We sent a bunch to him yeah. and his caddy. His caddy sent one back that in Japanese says, thank you, Barstool. That's classy. Yeah, very cool. You still have it? Very cool. Yeah, I framed it. Nice. Mm-hmm. All right. Um, reminder, we teamed up with DraftKings. Yeah. Uh, oh, good. Okay. Hashtag DK partner. We got something special going on. It's a huge week, big week. That's why this show is back. Wait a minute, does, does Chase, Chase and Greens, Greens have a read right now? If you didn't think Chase and Greens was legitimate, wow, kind of got three things going for you. One, okay. we were a deal breaker for the yeah, DraftKings the Barstool yeah. collaboration deal. Yeah. Dave gave us a little taste of his two million he won, which was nice. <laughs> yeah, really nice. The, the least we, the least he get it done. But go ahead. I sent him a uh, uh, quick text, okay. said, you know, congrats, and he just said thanks with no punctuation. It's anything. when, you, it's when you, you're all, high up at the company, all class. Yeah. Uh, we have a name, Chasing mm-hmm. Greens. Yep, great. And we have our first ad read in the history of the show. I'll stay out of the way. So, uh, new customers bet five dollars, get one hundred and fifty dollars in bonus bets instantly. You get those instantly. You just download the DraftKings Sportsbook app today. Use our promo code Greens. We have a promo code. Wow, Oof. Greens G R E E N S. Win signing up. Again, use our promo code Greens. It's going down in Augusta. So whether you're on the Greens, whether you're watching from home. Exciting time to get in on the action. It's why we have teamed up with DraftKings Sportsbook to dr- uh, to bring new customers an exciting offer. So once again, right now, all new customers who bet $5 will get $150 in bonus bets instantly. That's an offer you simply cannot refuse. Get in on the action now. Download the DraftKings app. Sign up. Use our promo code GREENS. DraftKings, the crown is yours. I might as well go all in. So pick, I, I, I think you figure out who I'm picking the win. Uh, Asian uh, winner plus Tiger Woods. A, Asian winner plus a thousand. Blasian winner. Tiger Woods. Will he count? He would count. He would count, right? Uh, he would count. Yeah, it, yeah I think plus so. a thousand. So I'll have Tiger in there as well. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm, I'm I'm picking obviously Matsuyama in tournament. The, the, any drama away here, but plus one thousand. I have a long shot. To, a long shot winner that I pick to win. Yeah. Ooh, give me a hint. New apparel. New apparel. That I would assume you don't love. Who is it? I'm, not, I'm thinking Tiger, obviously. It's not him. Who is it? Jason oh, Day. Oh, yeah. That's, that's a tough scene, yeah. Plus 6,000. That's a good bet. That, that's not a bad long shot bet. Yeah, I saw that they were... Uh, he's playing all right. Yeah, he's, he's playing better. He got, what, do you have a win last year? I think he got back in the winner's circle he last year. He won last year. He, yeah, he cried. Um, he's had a, you know, he's had some good performances yep. at the Masters. I saw in a little interview, I think he was talking about how much it meant when Adam Scott won, and he was kind of right there, and he loves the Masters more than anything, and blah, 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 blah. So Jason Day, plus 6,000, uh, long shot winner. It's kind of my, my long shot choice. I am going to uh, give you – I struggle with Ludwig this week. You know I love him, mm-hmm. but he hasn't played there before. I don't – I think I'm going to pass on him. I, I love one that I can't go near. He's playing – What's wrong with him? Th- of all the guys in the top 50, non-live, I think he has the lowest world ranking points this year. <laughs> He's done nothing. He was uh, the best player on the planet last and the, year. And the last year was the best player in the world. Um, and he almost won the Masters. He was, or, you know, he's in contention. In the final group with Kepka, <sighs> with the PGA. The year before, he should have won the Open. Uh, open, or yeah, he's right yeah, there to win yeah, the Open. Yeah, mm. played great at the Ryder Cup last year. Um, I'll give you a long shot winner, though. I don't think he's. I, I mean, if I had to pick a long shot, um, plus five thousand, Cam Young hmm. hasn't won yet, but has sniffed it. Playing a little better, I think. I think that course is good for him. He could have a little bit of a Matt Fitzpatrick. Fat, Fitzpatrick's first win over here was yeah, a major. That's true. Um, I like him, but plus two thousand is Matsuyama the win. That's that's my pick to win the tournament. You feel good about that? I think he's. 
if you wipe Scheffler off, Scheffler, like, remember a couple years ago, Dustin Johnson fell on the stairs? Uh-huh. If that happened. If that happened to Scheffler, Scheffler has God in the side, though. He's a God guy, so he wouldn't be hurt. But um, he, uh, he, he did give all the glory to God today in his interview. I heard that. I think, like, I watched both my parents die, like, right in front of me. I heard that. I'd rather Sorry watch that again than all the Scheffler parts of that Netflix show. <laughs> I think. That you're, was not, really... you're not a Scotty guy. You're not a uh, Caitlin Clark guy either. No, the, you you what? No, I, what did I say? That's see, you're, you're that's you're trying to make me an asshole. What? what be, I, you're be you're making yourself. A, you I, said to me, no. I said that. See, you're lying. I said I have no problem with Caitlin Clark. I don't like the people on Twitter who then start doing the oh, Caitlin Clark would be an NBA All Star. Like why? That's make her more too. than like. Then you're putting somebody in the position to be an asshole. Yeah, I, I agree with that part. And then you you texted me that I said, hey, people on Twitter that kiss her ass. Then you tweeted something right away. Yeah. You're like, oh, she's everything. No, I said, I, uh, I, I said, it's fair point that you hate all the people that do it, but I then I'm going yeah, to do it. I do it. Yeah, it gets you great traction. Yeah, of course, I mean, I'll, I'll be honest. You know, this mini golf. I won the major there last year. I won the Ryder Cup a major. Like she isn't. She's not the champion. I am. Uh, That's just a fact. I mean, I don't know. What, she's a loser. Like there are winners and losers. She happens to be a loser. She could. She could shoot. Great. How many people do you think could win the mini golf this week? Eight. That's a lot. Yeah, I'm being, I'm being, yeah, because I think there are some guys who haven't played, who might be better than we think. I can win, obviously. Jeff can win. I mean, you could Whitney. Uh, Whitney, you've never won, obviously, but you know, maybe, maybe. I'm 0 1. I played in one tournament. Yeah, it was a meltdown I, in the back. Uh, yeah, Norman but I played in one be. major. I, but I think you do have demons, though. No, no, no. I uh, remember Brooks Kepka last year after the Masters. He still won't tell everybody what he learned that day. Yes. That then propelled him <laughs> to win. I learned something about myself that day that is going to really help me. This okay, I've been okay, good. Waiting I, I, yeah, a I, year for this. Jeff, he won in, in the Hamptons. Jeff could win. Um, then there were guys like Che and Smitty who were play well in the Hamptons. Whitney, you mentioned like that's like six or seven guys right there. Yeah. Okay. All maybe right. it's an, one of these new guys we don't know. Uh, maybe they play well. I don't know. Uh, I believe last year I was the only member of the four play team to make the cut. Is that true? Yeah. Yeah. And our final rapper missed the cut. They all three missed the cut. Which is which is crazy. There were there was like I mean didn't Dave's mom make the cut? <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I I forgot that Hannah Cook was in, in the final group. It was you, was. me, Dave, and Hannah Cook. She shot a, a six hundred in the final. Uh... Look, anybody could collapse the final round. Happened yeah. to me. You think you think she'll ever come back to Barstool or no? She's yeah she's she's here. Oh, is that true? Yeah, yeah, she's okay. she's. Oh, I didn't know that. Again, she uh, might beat the four play guys again. Who knows? Oh, she's in the tournament. I think she's in the oh, tournament. I would, I would, and the girl who shoots uh, animals is in the tournament too. That's right. Yeah, which I'm fine with. Oddly, I would love that. I would love if they released a deer during the tournament. She killed it on the course. That would be to me like good. <laughs> that's good cross promotion. Oddly, like I, you know, she, she was uh, petrified of rattlesnakes. Really? Yeah. Yeah, because I posted a couple of seen a few out in Arizona, whatever, and she, it's all she wanted to talk about. What a great video. Well, I'm sorry. How did I miss that tweet? It was a good one. On Twitter, you put videos? No, I just put them on Instagram. No. Oh, on my that. Instagram story. I don't have that. Yeah, you're not on that stuff. I also don't have, I walk two miles from the hotel to here because I don't have Uber. <laughs> <laughs> Is it two miles? Yes. <laughs> or take it. It was fun. It's a nice day out, so I was happy to walk. Better than the traffic. Traveling all day, and like I was like, I'll fucking walk anyway, but I was like, uh, it was a sad scene to watch me try and fly, like wave down the cab. <laughs> It is a uh, it is a weird distance we're in, like a weird spot. It's just far enough that I it's wish, annoying. So Uber, it's just an app, <laughs> but like, how do you have money for it? I don't understand. Uh, we're not gonna go. Okay, I'm just saying. I literally, I, I you, literally, can you? Do I just put money in it? Yeah, like, you, can, I you take your like cash, you roll account. it up, and you just <laughs> jam I, I, it I in the bottom of your phone. phone. Yeah, I was, <laughs> I'm literally cabs <laughs> are going by, and I'm like taxi. I think it's like 1976. Cash looking at you, yeah, he's like, "What the fuck?" He's is like, wrong, "Open dude? your fucking app, <laughs> Jesus asshole." Uh, you have any other picks? Uh, the only other pick that I kind of okay, had no tiger pick from you. The only other pick that I had was Tiger Woods over three and a half birdies in the first round as well is plus one thirty. What was Wyndham Clark? Minus one fifteen. Oh, okay. I mean, I think. I mean, yeah, I think he'll make birdies. Like, I think as long, yeah, I, I think that's good. Okay. Oh, I got a couple birdies on par fives, a couple yeah. on a, uh, you know, I think the sixth hole he likes to hit it in there close, especially if we get a back right pin or something because he can carve a cut in there. So uh, uh, seven, he loves birdie seven if it's ever on that right tier because he cuts it in there. So yeah, obviously, I, I mean, I mean, two, eight, 13, and 15 are all part. I mean, birdies, two of those, you get it. You're in business. Now we're, right now we're, now we're rolling. So I, I, I like that bet a lot. I'm going to put a, a, a responsible amount on that with. I got one more tradition. I got to do it. DK partner. Fred? Plus 600 top 40 Fred Couples. Yeah. 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 I made the cut last year. Tiger's 
spoke nicely of him today. Play well today. Yeah, they're both gassing each other up. I think he. I think you know. Is it sixty four years old? Can he finish in the top forty? Maybe six to one odds. Oh, he made the cut last year. Uh, has he been playing at all? He's had some back issues this year. Okay, not a great start. Yeah, that makes yeah. me a little concerned. I agree. He was not optimistic, but right. six to one. All um, right. So the picks are in. All right, picks are in. I feel good about this. Who year's are you picking matches. the win-win? Like if you like, like forget bet. Who are you picking to win the tournament? Remove Scotty and remove my long shot, Jason Day. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And I, uh, I actually really like Brooks. Yeah, I just never know what to do with him. I don't know either. I know what you're saying. I mean, like, if you sh- he'll probably shoot 66 tomorrow. So it's just that mindset that he's got, and I and. It sounds stupid, but all the other four means fucking nothing with the guy. He's got, what, four PGA Tour wins and five majors? Yeah, it's crazy. So none of that matters. So I uh, a couple of live wins, too, I think. So I like Matsuyama. And I like Sh- I do like Xander, but he never wins. He's seven straight top 20s in majors. He plays well here. Like, one of these tournaments he's going to win, I think. I think it's going to be the Masters. I could see him being a Masters. Me, too. Guy. I it would just... not be. I would say if somebody want to sprinkle something on him, too, I would. Yeah, he's going to get I that. Would, I could look at. I could not be surprised. I would not be surprised. Do you think uh, Rory. Do you think Rory wins the Masters before no. he's done? Nope. Yeah. I just think he's Tiger never. Tiger was very confident about that today. What's he going to say? No. That'd be interesting. If he said he's no. never going to win the Masters. I, I hope I'm wrong. I got nothing against Rory. He, he tries too hard to be nice, but I have no. Like, I have no, but you know what I mean? He's like, so, it's like, just relax, Rory. Like, you can be an asshole once in a while. And um, what if he's just nice, though? What if nice people are just nice? Once he didn't, like, t- tell Jay Monahan to fuck off, I was done. Yeah. Like, I'm like, I mean, imagine if Monahan did, like, and by the way, what is, like, I thought they were merging. Like, what the fuck is going on? I don't know what the hell's going on. They're be quiet. You have no about idea? <laughs> I, I will say, uh, I think, like, John Rahm even looked pissed yeah, off. Yeah, today he was like, I don't know. He's like, I, I'll be honest, when I got signed over here, I kind of thought it was going to be the tipping point. Nope. Not the tipping point. Now they're just kind of in limbo. But Didn't give his money back, though, right? I doubt it. No. Seems unlikely. So the picks are in. Mm-hmm. So we will see you next at the U.S. Open, which is at... When else the U.S. Open this year? Good old Piners, baby. Oh, of course. Mm-hmm. That's that's going to be... That's a big spot for you. Huge. You're staying there that week. I'll right? be there all week. How many people are staying with you? I got my parents coming in. No, it's nice. I got my brother. Jim and Elaine. His family coming in. Yep. I've got another couple friends with their small family. Who do you claim your dad looks like? And then you had no proof of it? Mark Messier. Mark Messier, right. My dad looks a lot like Mark right. Messier. Provided no proof of that famously. He's not on social media. I don't have that many like pictures. I understand. Of, I understand. You know, I, understand. <laughs> sure. I was trying to find it. Sure. He does look like Mark Messier. I believe you. I, I promise. Sure. No, I believe you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you have, the whole crowd's going to be there. Yeah, big crowd. That's a great spot. Open. You know I love that spot. I know you do. Good. I know you do. Tiger, uh, um, Tiger Woods is going to be, you know, that'll probably be our last shot to get him playing in the U.S. Open. It's crazy to think they'll that, give him an exemption, fun. but if he's not in it, he doesn't have an exemption after next year. Wild. Right? 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Yeah. No. 19. He won in 19. So then 20, 20 he gets exemption. 21, 22, 23. Yeah, last chance. Okay. I'm glad we got there. I think they'll probably give him an exemption. I would think so. Yeah. This, anyway, that's this, next for us. This is a good US Open for because it's Piner's pretty flat. It's not the hardest walk in the world. It's going to be hot. True. Uh, that's true. Yeah, he'll be there. Anyway, all right. So that's it. Anything else? I think that's all I got. Big thanks to our massive, you know, sponsor that we oh, brought home. We're DraftKings. Bet responsibly. Please. But uh, but yeah, I think it's I I think it's gonna be a good good Masters this week. Good Masters. I'm excited. I'm excited. All right, we'll see you at the U.S. Open. Yeah. Bye.